As a brand designer, one of the most common requests I get is to create sales deck. Whether pitching to investors, presenting to retailers or launching a new product, the right sales deck can make or break that first impression. The only slight problem is that they take forever to create. So today I want to test out something. I'm going to be designing a complete sales pitch deck for a new beverage brand in under 30 minutes using Gamma. Usually this would take me anywhere between 8 to 10 hours but with using Gamma, let's see how much time it takes us. Probably going to be designing it under 30 minutes but let's see how it goes. Alright, before we do that, let us talk about what exactly is the problem. When I create decks for my clients, most of the time is spent in formatting, setting up grids, aligning text box, importing visuals and tweaking layouts. If you think about it, none of that is exactly creative. It is just busy work. That is exactly why Gamma caught my eye. It is an AI presentation tool that promises to generate content and layout within minutes. But I wanted to test it myself and see if Gamma could actually deliver something professional enough that I could actually be comfortable showing it to my clients. So let's go ahead and now do that. All right, let us start fresh. I'll be opening Gamma on my screen right now. And, and for the users who are seeing this for the first time, this is their entire app and the workspace basically you can see here. This is my workspace. Yes, I have worked on a few projects before in this as well. It is private, so you're not allowed to uh, see it. But what we'll do is we'll click on create new AI. There are a bunch of options right here. Paste in text, create from notes and outline or existing content. We can do that. We can generate a one line prompt in a few seconds, which I've already used before, as you can see, or we can import a file or a URL of existing documents or presentations if you want to move ahead from that. But this is one of the prompts which I had created before making a presentation for a personalized proposal for a web design client. Yes, I have used that. But what I want to show you right now is how you can generate an entire presentation and create a sales deck with just lines of prompts. So let's type in create a sales pitch deck for a new beverage brand that is launching a line of sparkling fruit drinks. The deck should focus on brand story, product features and retail partnerships. All right, so it's simple, pretty clear, two lines of prompts. One, we've told it to create a sales deck for a new beverage brand that is launching a line of sparkling fruit drinks. So we've given a specific type of drink that is launching. And we have also told the deck what it should exactly focus on. So we wanted to focus on the brand story, the product features and retail retail partnerships. Now, before we go ahead and click on generate, there are much of options that we have. We can choose the number of cards we exactly want. Of course, once you have the Pro and Plus subscription, you can do as much as 50 cards. Probably that's too much for a sales deck. The sales deck should be quick, short. So I feel like 10 cards will be like that sweet spot where I think it's good enough. Then you can have a default layout, a traditional layout. I think we'll go with a traditional layout. We can also have a fluid layout, but I think for this one, I want the deck to be horizontal and 16 by nine ratio. I'll go with that. Obviously, I'm gonna go choose English for this one but there are multiple different languages for you to choose from here. Wow there is even Tamil and Telugu to choose from that's crazy and then what would you like to create we can create a web page we can create a document a social media post but we're going to stick to presentation and we're going to now generate it online and as you can see gamma has started doing this thing and it's generating something it has given me a bunch of information already i think these are like the gist of the slides that's going to be there so yeah these are total of 10 cards that's going to be there i have multiple different options i can do right now so in the start it has given like a header it has already given a name for that sparkling fruit drinks which i did not tell it to give spark Fizz is the name. Then their story from Orchard to Sparkle, founded in 2025 by fruit lovers. Sparkfizz difference, how it is different from its competitors. Then the product lineup, it has given me flavors like mango mint twist, berry citrus burst, apple ginger fizz and seasonal additions. Wow, that is interesting. Packaging that pops, marketing opportunities. So it has given me what all these cards will include like a gist of it and I can obviously go ahead and drag it to my order or I can if I don't like something I can always go and change it but we're not going to do that for now. We're going to go down to the interesting section where we can customize our gamma. So we have this card right here where we can customize it to minimal, concise, detail or extensive. I feel like concise is good enough. We don't want minimal. It's a pitch deck. People want numbers. People want information. So too detailed and too extensive will be like overselling it. So I think concise is a, a good way to begin with. For our theme, I think we'll go with something like Malibu. I think that really speaks to me, especially for like a fizzy drink, like a fun fizzy drink. Of course, we have AI images right here. We have a lot more options to go from. We can source images from AI. We can select it. Okay, I want stock images. I want web images. I want illustrations. I think I'll go with AI images. And for the model, it is also giving us what model it should actually go 
move with. We can literally select anywhere from GPT image generation to DALI. We can also generate Gemini. I think soon a uh, Google banana <laughs> that might also come uh, here. But yeah, for now we'll let it auto select because it will choose the best image generation tool for us. And we can go with illustration style, but I feel like let's have a, a 3D style to it. I think that'll be very interesting. And here we'll add playful, feminine, modern, and vibrant. Yes, very much. Not, not exactly cute, but I would say glossy is the vibe. And now with all the information selected with everything we have put in, let us go ahead and click on generate and let's see what it gives us. All right, so Gamma is doing its thing now. Um, I like how it is showing me that it's actually designing instead of just giving me the final results. So it feels like I am sitting right here, I've given my prompt and now it is just doing its thing. It is designing for me. So that's interesting. One thing I can see which I really want to change is the font. I don't like the font which it has given. The good part is that you can literally change the font at one place and prompt it to change it everywhere. That is, is a very good thing. All right, so like what you created, let us be the judge of that. Let me go up and see if I like what you created. We will start with our first page. Before starting, one thing I actually really like is that how Gamma has changed the entire theme of the interface. So I just gave it one specific theme for the presentation but it also has changed the background color and it has matched the entire theme just so that it fits in with the vibe which we are trying to create all right spark fizz as we saw from our previous prompt was our choice of name which gamma gave and the new wave of sparkling fruit drinks all right this is good this is fun this is really vibrant this is really playful which i wanted also it sort of matched the color scheme which we were going with our story from watch it to sparkle it has given us icons we can also change these icons right here this is very nice this is a very good layout in fact yeah i don't like this layout specifically but look at this layout this is so clean super nice there's an image on the top horizontal with the glass in focused talking about the fruitiness in the sparkling beverage and 100% natural, perfectly sparkling and health conscious. That's very good. I'm pretty happy with what it has created, but let us add some customization and let us add some of our own branding, our own touch. So this brand uses bright topical colors, bold typography and a playful logo. I upload the palette. As you can see right here, we can go to the theme. We can also change the theme if we like. If we feel like this has become too pink, we can directly change the theme and it will change it throughout the presentation. That is the best part. I believe it is also change the images because right now the images are on theme like if you look at the background color of this image if you go here and look at this image it is exactly on theme now this has given us some generative images but let's say if you want to add our own image or generate it right here we can go here and generate our own image right here as to how we exactly want it let's say you have your brand deck ready you have your colors you have your fonts you have even your logo you can upload it right here and it will synchronize the entire presentation based on that this is, I'm just going through the presentation. This is actually really nice. I mean, I'm just imagining that this happened with like, I would say five minutes of prompting and choosing the theme and everything. And just 10 seconds of waiting for it to go on. And probably like, if I spend more time to create the brand, probably 30 minutes. So like under 30 minutes, I'm ready with my sales pitch deck. So like, if I wanna change the color, I can just, you know, directly do that. So, and in under 30 minutes, I can create this entire sales pitch deck, which would usually take me hours and hours to create. And on the screen right here, I'm gonna show you two presentation, comparing one gamma right here, which I created in 30 minutes, and one generic PowerPoint, which can take me hours and hours to create and execute, and not know even if after so many hours of work, I would get that sales pitch or not. So after this experiment, here is what I think. Gamma did not just generate slides. It actually gave me breathing room to think about the brand story and how to present it in a way that feels compelling, not only to your clients, but even your fellow designers. Don't get me wrong, as a designer, I still control the fonts, the colors, the logo, the packaging. Gamma will just take away all the repetitive tasks that will slow me down. I still use Illustrator or Figma, whichever I choose from for building out brand identities. But for sales decks, presentations, client pitches, or even proposals, Gamma fits perfectly in that process. 
So there it is, a sales deck for a beverage brand made in literally 30 minutes instead of 10 hours. And to be honest, it feels like a real shift on how I actually approach client work. This is not only going to help me, but also help my sales manager, my general manager, my HR, because we create presentations every single day uh, in terms of hiring, in terms of presenting it to the new clients, in terms of closing deals. Presentations are literally created every day. And with Gamma, it's going to be so much easier now. And now I want to hear from you guys. If you had Gamma, what project would you first create or work on? 